to my channel so i've just got in uh hold on i forgot to take my headphones off oh uh, yeah that's better my ears are not hurting no more that mask around the ears i tell you what it's so painful um so i've just got home uh so basically i went out on a, a dvd uh not dvd a blu-ray hunt you know i need some more blu-rays to watch some films to keep me entertained by being indoors so i've got a couple of blu-rays um and then I've got a few bits in Iceland and then a few bits in uh, Morrison's uh, because I noticed I was on my way home. I realised I forgot a, a part of the main ingredient for my dinner for tonight and I thought, oh no. So I had to stop off on the way home and get a bit of slaw. So that's what I did and I'll unpack everything. I'll show you what I got and then uh, make a start on dinner. It's just a few bits here guys. So I needed back sacks. Uh, I got a chicken bar because it was on a reduce. Um, some sweets to watch my movies. Um, they were three for a pound. Um, I only, only buy the two pack because keep buying the four pack of pork pies. It's not good. Uh, some coleslaw, uh, some corned beef. Now, when I was uh, having my blood done um, yesterday, uh, what they do is. Um, after you've had it, they get you to sit down for 15 minutes, make sure you're out, make sure that you have some chocolate and a drink before you leave. Uh, I was well looked after. Um, I picked up these. Uh, I didn't go in there for these, but I see them and I thought, you know what? You know, I, I do like a reduced item. Um, who doesn't? So um, I picked them up. Um, and obviously I picked these up. They're my favourite mini cheddars. And I thought I've not had... Uh, the smoky barbecue for a while so i thought while well, they're on offer for a pound each you know they're usually 170 a packet i think so uh, i picked them up so that is you know just a few bits i i mainly went out you know for the black sacks and obviously a few items for dinner and stuff uh obviously a bottle of pepsi max you know uh, that what i like to have that's it so what i'm gonna do is uh i'm going to start dinner and then after dinner, I'll, uh, I'll show you the new Blu-rays that I've picked up. So here is my chicken for dinner. So it's the Chinese one from the butchers. Uh, and we have this with some southern fried wedges. So this is going to be a quite quick, simple dinner. It only takes 15 minutes. So we want to go to air crisp and we want to go temperature for 190. Oh. And we want to cook for 15. So there you go, so I've added in the wedges, my two bits of chicken, and that's pretty much what you need to do. Pop the lid on and press start. That's pretty much it. There you go. Two, one. It is ready. Oh, look at that. Now I just need to cook the uh, food probe it to make sure it is cooked, so bear with me. It's not quite cooked, so I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna up up the temperature to 200 and I'm gonna do it for three minutes. So it's not quite to the temperature that it should be. It should be 73.8, it's on 64.0, so just give it a bit longer. So I've checked the temperature, it's a lot better now. So it's about 77 degrees, so that is perfect. So now let's we'll just serve up the wedges. Right, so, I've got my wedges, my chicken, and that all I need now is my is my slaw. As my good friend uh, Dave, he calls it cow off. Sorry, just it's not. There we go. Just I'm gonna go for two teaspoons. There we go. And there we have it. The dinner is served. Well, guys, the dinner was delicious. I I did enjoy that. It's been a long time since I've had it. If you like that sort of uh, chicken, uh, definitely uh, if you've got a ninja, it makes life so much simple. Anyway, I'm going to uh, show you my Blu-rays now and uh, let's get a uh, crack on with this and get this video done. So these are the new ones that I got. Um, <laughs> there's a few here. Uh, so let's, let's, let's make a start. Uh, so, you know, most of these were all under £8. So I think that's quite, quite a good price. Um, so the Exorcist, uh, I got that from eBay and that was £4.20, which I thought this is the original first one, uh, which I quite enjoyed this one. Um, I had this already, but I've lost the, the sleeve. Uh, I must have got someone signed it and 
I think I've misplaced it. I can't find it, so I got it again. And that was only two pounds. So that was from Panland. The Karate Kid collection is the only one that was quite, well, I wouldn't say it's expensive, but a lot more than the rest. Uh, because this is the whole collection, um, one to four, and that is, that was fourteen ninety nine. But this is only cut, only got released in the UK last year, so I thought that was a good price, fifteen quid for a new movie. Um, this kickboxer, um, I am trying to get the other kickboxers, um, but this one was one pound ninety. Yep, off off Amazon, one pound ninety, which I thought was quite cheap. I was going to go CX and get it for a pound, but I thought for an extra 90p, get it delivered to my house for an extra 90p and it is brand new and sealed. Piranha, I do like Piranha. Uh, they are, well, I've, I've seen this one. Uh, obviously, I'm a big fan of Kelly Brook, so it's the reason I got that. That was only a pound from CEX. This was a pound from CX as well, which I didn't know they did this one. So I'm going to check this one out and uh, see what this is like. But, you know, it's got the Hoff in it. Uh, I am a big Hoff fan. So uh, it's another reason why I got this movie. Southpaw, uh, I got the pit, I picked this up in Poundland, uh, £2. So I thought I'd give that a go. And bringing on to these movies. Now, these are my favourite movies, okay? Uh so these are the Annabelle movies. Uh, they're all linked together with uh, The Conjuring or Conjuring, however you, you want to pronounce it. Uh, so these are in order of uh, the order that you should watch them. Okay, so The Nun, I actually like this. I actually went to the cinema to uh, watch this. I went twice, believe it or not, that I did enjoy that. I did enjoy that film. And then it's Annabelle Creation. Um, I got that from uh, CEX. Majority of these films were from CEX. And then it's Annabelle. I do love these films. Then Conjuring, another good one. So this is, uh, the, this um, only come today. Uh, got this from Amazon, 7 99 I was gonna get it from CEX, but CEX was six pound. But by the time I would have got the bus there, and then the bus back, it's just cheaper to get it delivered to my house. Uh, so I did, uh, $7.99, so, and it's brand new and sealed. You see there. And this, if you've not seen this, this is quite a good film. It came out in 2019, and it was only a fiver, which, I thought, you know, it's a good price. And then the second one of this is good. Uh, I enjoy, I mean, I enjoyed all these films. They are my favourites. So now I've got all the seven movies. I'm going to be doing a marathon on them. And I'm going to be watching all of them in, in the correct order. So these are my new, new additions to keep me busy. So I am working on my Blu-rays. Um, I don't have many. Uh, so we're just going to go quick look this is a nice special edition one um but i got a fair well so most of these blu-rays are actually signed i've got some still books as well so the man of steel was signed by each character it's just a just a few blu-rays there and here's my james bond collection ignore the freddy vs jason <laughs> but yeah i uh i do love this james bond collection I think the 007 on the spine looks really cool. And obviously, I know this is not Blu-ray, but because this is signed by Freddy itself, it's got to come out with this, because I'm eventually going to be putting shelves on the wall. There's a mark on that wall. No. Um, I put shelves up so I can display my Blu-rays. And that's it. So yeah, some good films. Um, there is a new one. Uh, Conjuring 3 is coming out. Uh, coming out this year, actually. I'm not quite sure when. But they said it's going to be a 21 release. But I'm not holding my breath. Uh, because last year a lot of films were meant to come out. And they haven't. So everything's been pushed back. So this might happen with this one. But hopefully not. But uh, yeah, they are my favourite horror films. 
Uh, but that is the end of today's video. So I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next video. Take care. Bye.